Are you a Star Wars fan? Want to have your own Star Destroyer? Join me today as we go through Kira all the way to the final print of a Star Wars Star Destroyer from the original trilogy. See you inside. Hello and welcome to today's video. Today, like I said, we are printing a Star Wars Star Destroyer. So let's get down to some business real quick first. First, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button if you like what you're seeing here. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button, every subscribe, every like. Hit that bell for the notifications of every time a new time lapse or a how-to video comes out. So as I said today, we're printing a Star Wars Star Destroyer. Uh, I believe this is the second iteration, not, this is from the original trilogy. So we're getting it ready on the build plate. I'm using a Creality CR-10. To print this, I'm using Inland Pro PLA Plus. So first, we're gonna get this guy sized up here and cure it onto my build plate to get it ready to go. I wanna print this almost as big as I can because why not? I mean, that's the whole point, right? So we've got it pretty well in my build space. Um, I'm gonna increase my raft size just to make sure I get good ad plate adhesion since this is printing from an odd back triangle. I am printing this upright just to try to make it easier, less supports. Um, try to get a cleaner print out of this. So we're gonna finish getting these settings in place and we're gonna get to printing. So I hope you guys enjoy this time-lapse as we get this sliced and get it ready to go. All right, and you can see we've got it printed. We're cleaning it up now. I did have a lot of stringing on the model. That's why you see me going with the X-Acto knife, just kind of cleaning it up, doing a scraping method. Um, believe me, you'll be glad I took the audio off on this one because it screech across the chalkboard. But I'm getting it cleaned up, getting it ready for a gray primer, which you're about to see here in a second, that I got it cleaned up and we got it ready to rock and roll. So here's the finished model primered. Um, I still have some painting and stuff to do to it. I just have it in primer right now, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video and we'll see you next time.